What is good friends, we're back with more Smog 2's playoffs. We do have Blunder vs ABR that's starting off with Black and White. This is round 2, so it's basically top 8. They both have Dragon Spam teams with 2 Steel type. No Magnus on though, which is kind of interesting. Uh, looking at the teams, I think that's either uh, Scarf, Ladi or Scarf, Trump on both sides. Probably a Breaker High Dragon on Blunder side, either Specs or Life Op, Offensive, Spin, Starmie, Bulky, Ferrothorn. Um, also, we do see sometimes Scarf Scissor on Black White. Like I said, I think one of the dragons is going to be a Scarfer, so I don't think the Scissor is going to be Scarfed. I guess it could be Banded, and I think that usually carries U turn, Bullet Punch, Superpower, and Pursuit. And on ABR side, I do think that's a potential Bandit Kyurem. A Bulky Sloking with like Slack of Ice Beam, Flamethrower, Scald. And the Ladi or the Chomper is the Scarfer. I'm actually thinking the Ladi is the Scarfer more on ABR side. I don't think it's gonna have HP Fire because he has a Heat Um that can. Um, that has Fire Courage and he has a Slow Bro that, with Fire Courage that can both beat Ferrothorn. So I think ABR is forced to switch here. Blunder is either gonna U turn uh, or if he has Pursuit, he can just Pursuit and remove the Ladi turn 1. And he does just do that. Chat's gonna go wild now, just watch. <laughs> we all know how this goes. ABR is gonna be able to go heat turn here and get his rocks up. The thing is, um, Blunder has a spinner in Starmie and ABR has no spin blocker. So uh, Blunder can pretty much uh, spin the rocks away immediately with Starmie. Um, not 100% sure what Starmie carries in in Black White. I guess Hydro Pump spin. Then either um, Psychic Step and then Ice Beam or T Bolt in the last slot. Or maybe uh, they sometimes, don't, sometimes they don't carry Psy Shock or Psychic. I think sometimes they just carry Bolt Beam. Uh, ABR is most likely gonna go to Sloking. Donna is just gonna spin, is what I'm thinking here. Um, also, the Hydreigon on Blunder's team most likely has some sort of fighting coverage. If he's a Focus Blast, the superpower, because um, he twin walls Hydreigon's steps, right? The steps being um, Dark Pulse and. Uh, Draco. <coughs> okay, so he does have Protect. I guess that gives him information about Blunder's Starmie. Now he's gonna switch to Sloking. But Blunder is still just gonna spin here. Try to catch ABR on a stay in there, okay. This is just Rapid Spin and we... Um, okay, we do see it's a Life Up Starmie. So there's the option that the Starmie has T-Bolt, but um, I think... I might not do it kill the sloking. So ABR is either gonna scald or ice beam here. Ice beam would be if he doesn't want the high dragon to come in for free. Otherwise the scald is fine. Now my high dragon does look like a threat to ABR. Like especially like I said if it has fighting coverage for Heatran. Okay, so it does have T Bolt and it's looking like a 2 hit KO. Um, maybe it's a roll with after leftovers. So if it's a roll, maybe I can hope that he lives here and slack off and stay in. Otherwise, he's gonna be have he's gonna have to switch out into either Kyurem or Garchomp. Um, I think Kyurem will if ABR switches Kyurem is the safer switch because um, yeah, ABR um stays in. Wow. But like I said, if he switched, he wouldn't he shouldn't have gone Chomp. He could have gone Kyurem, but yeah, staying in worked out there. We're not over predicting. And Blunder's gonna have to switch now. Most likely in High Dragon, yeah. Maybe I went into Heatran, I don't know if he predicted the High Dragon. Or if he predicted something else. But yeah, what is it? is probably just gonna get the rocks up. Maybe yeah, Blunder's gonna go for the, the fighting move, exactly. And that is a super bulky Heatran. That's not only max HP, that also has Fist Dev investment. Uh, depends on the High Dragon spread. If the High Dragon is like, um, no it's physical attack investment life orb then this doesn't have to be max defense but otherwise I think this is even max defense heat yeah I think it's I think it's close to max defense heat yeah if it's not max I've never seen that like when I played started playing competitive that crit is uh, definitely unfortunate when I started playing competitive um I've never seen fist death heat maybe once in a ladder so Garchomp comes out here and you can either go for SD and then threaten Ferrothorn with a fire thing, or you can just go hard for like a Dragon Claw or Outrage. Because if Blunder can, Blunder can go into like a Ladi, 
placed in the SD, so that's why um, ABR might just go hard for a drag move. I'm not 100% sure what the Hedron would have done um, on a turn where it got crit, probably like Toxic. Yeah, but I don't know what Hedron carries in Black White. They just sex their dragon. Um, I mean, it's understandable, but it would have still been nice for the slow king. But Blunder probably has like other me measures for slow king. So Garchomp is locked in and it's forced to be sacked off. Oh yeah, it was, it was Dragon Gem Garchomp, which is interesting. So Blunder's now going to switch to uh, Scissor or Ferrothorn here. Oh no, the Blunder can just spin here, what am I saying? Blunder can just spin here because it's most likely not Scarf Curum. So he gets rid of the spin before he dies. And we do see a Dragon Clock Curum. So it's most likely Bandit Curum. We do see that Stami was faster, so it wasn't uh, wasn't Scarf Curum. And Blunder is probably just gonna go for U-turn here. He doesn't lose anything from clicking U-turn. Um, if Curum is like Curum is most likely locked in a Dragon Claw. I don't know if Scissor always carries max HP on band. Cause the rank is 38, so that means that um like I've run some calcs um in black white too because I don't play black black white that much, so I'm like familiar with the tier somewhat. I think that's uh, if it's banded that is a mineral. I think I calc that like mineral was like 38% on, on, on Scissor, max HP Scissor. So Blunder can uh Expect a slow king to come out here from ABR side. So if he has SD here, that would be a fire play on a slow king. But I assume he's just gonna dragon claw here. That's 36. So that's definitely um some sort of fifth step invested slow king. I mean we have seen earlier that the T build from Starmy did a good chunk, so that wasn't obviously isn't that that speed dev invested the slow king. So yeah, Slokin can threaten the the Garchomp with an Ice Beam here. But if, it, if it's Yachi, it can live with the Ice Beam. I don't think he revealed his item yet, right? Like, ABR revealed that he was Dragon Gem, but uh, uh, Blana didn't reveal his item. He flamethrowed that trying to catch the Scissor slash Ferrothorn. And this uh, this is rough now for ABR. It's looking like Blunder has this game pretty much. He does go on a Balloon Drill expecting the Earthquake. But Banda's either gonna be able to tweet KO this with Dragon Claw or if he has fire coverage, he can just Oko it with fire coverage. And yeah, I don't see if you are winning this at all. Yeah, he has fire fame. Excalibur just dies. I mean Dragon Claw or like oh, yeah, Dragon Claw we already showed that. Dragon Claw also would have tweet KO'd, I think. And now he can go slow king, but now what's cure? I guess he had to like Bluff a Scarf and hope the Blunder switches, but I think, no, it was already revealed that he's not Scarf, yeah. So the game was just over there, and he does get the burn, but oof. it doesn't matter at that point. Blunder also has Lumberry. Like, even if, it, if he didn't have Lumberry, it didn't matter at that point, I'm pretty sure. And yeah, Blunder takes game one. We're going to be back in a bit with uh, game two. And yeah, hopefully, um, not hopefully, but a tier I know a bit more about. Um, Gen 6 or Gen 7 then. Y even though like my Gen 6 is not even, like I don't even know that much about Gen 6 anymore because I haven't played it in a fat minute. But my Gen 7, um, the Gen 7 is like, I'm super hyped for like the new infos. We got like the leaks for Ultra Sun and Moon. <laughs> but yeah, stay tuned for that, have a fantastic day. Smash that like button if you want to see more and peace out friends.